here today, Felicia Nino, with the San Antonio Humane Society. And you brought your furry friends, yes, didn't you? Yes, <laughs> of course, of course. They're looking amazing in their official groves. So we're very excited and thankful to everyone who participated. And these are, of course, we have El Rey Fido, 17, Aww. who is Happy Happy Hazel, and her mama Sarah. <laughs> <laughs> so if El Rey Fido is a big fundraising event. Yes, it people is. people that don't know all about it, right? Yeah, so uh, at the San Antonio Society, we're a local nonprofit organization that's been around since 1952. So all of the funds that are donated and all of the support that comes through for the fundraising competition goes back to all of the pets here in San Antonio, which is a huge huge, wonderful thing. So they actually raised over $100,000 for our pets at the shelter this oh, year, wow. which is amazing. So yes. how many how many animals in total raised $100,000? I want to say around 11 or 12 that we had total in the competition. Wow, and they that's have, a tough competition. It really is. It really is. So the top five fundraisers become El Rey Fido and the members of the Royal Court. And uh, so they make medals, they have events, they're all over social media, spreading the it's word to their thing. friends and family. Yeah, this yes, is a big definitely. Deal. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, like I said, we have Hazel here, and then we also have Bet Midger so and her mama Hazel. Heather. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that's too cute. <laughs> that's too cute. <laughs> so tell us about Hazel. So Hazel is, uh, she's actually a therapy dog, and she goes and visits with kiddos Aww. and at the bereavement center <laughs> she'll be going very soon and the ronald mcdonald club so she is out and about you know spreading awareness and showing love to all sorts of people out there and a brand and ambassador she <laughs> is for frenchie's <laughs> kitchen so very thankful to miss hazel is she, she's a a sweet girl. she is a french okay. bulldog oh, yeah hazel, aren't she the cutest thing Isn't ever adorable? how do the kids react to her <laughs> yeah oh gosh yeah, Beautiful. she has a great time. She has a great time. So you'll often see her with her therapy vest on. Mm -hmm. But right now, of course, she's sporting her grove and her, her uh, so <laughs> crown. <laughs> I know a lot of the other royalty. They go yes. to different parties and different events and, mm -hmm. and represent. How about... Yeah, so Fido. we will be at Fiesta Fiesta on Thursday, of course, to kick okay. off everything. And uh, we'll be we'll have our medals and our T-shirts for sale for Pin Pandemonium. And we will be walking in the parade also. So we're very excited about that. And then, of course, we have our El Rey Fido coronation <laughs> that's taking place on Saturday. From and we have another visitor that just we showed do, up. Do, let's let's go Sophie. In. Slide in there. Sophie is our princess of welcome the food fashion. Ball. Ball. <laughs> that's okay. We'll allow it because it looks so darn cute. <laughs> And Ashton, thank you, Ashton, for bringing yes, Sophie. Thank very thankful and happy that she was able to be here as well. So, yeah, like we're just very thankful for everyone who participated and everyone that donated. And the coronation on Saturday yes. is... It's happening again, this Saturday from 10 to 11 at the Sheridan Gunter downtown. Okay. It's free. It's an official fiesta event, got and it. you can definitely bring your dogs with you. So I was dress just going to ask all those questions, time. but yeah. you got to answer. So free, family friendly, and yes. bring the furry friends. Yes, I love please. It. And you'll see Hazel get uh, <laughs> <laughs> crowned by Ray Fayo. You'll get to celebrate all of the wonderful accomplishments that everyone. So, did. without letting Hazel hear this, has her attitude changed? <laughs> getting no. crowned. She's become a lot more friendly. <laughs> She's friendly in general, always, all the head. time. It has okay. not gone to her head. She's the, wearing her crown, and we're surprised that she's keeping that thing on all the time. So she's excited. <laughs> the San Antonio Humane Society obviously does so much wonderful work. You got a lot of money from this, but how can mm -hmm. folks help out? So in general, if anyone wants to donate to the shelter, they can definitely go to sahumane.org slash donate and give a monetary donation. Or if you would like to help by bringing items to our shelter, you can do that as well. Or the Brooks Spaniarder Clinic, which we operate on Brooks. So you can bring towels, blankets, um, newspaper, you know, whatever you have at home that you are not using, we can mm -hmm. definitely use it at the shelter and it, it benefits all of our pets. So anything that you can do would be wonderful. And one of the things to mention also is since we are a local nonprofit organization, it's really important to note that we are not affiliated with the Humane Society of the United States. Mm -hmm. okay. So everything that you're able to give here to the San Antonio Humane Society helps local pets, which is really, really important. Okay, and there's a lot of volunteering opportunities, fostering uh, opportunities. Definitely. And there. So, yeah. All right, well, if you'd like more information on the San Antonio Humane Society, visit salive.com and click on the As Seen on SA Live tab. And you can hear more about... The coronation. Oh, yes, the coronation. Yes, yeah. and it's free, family friendly, and you can bring the pups. Yeah. Thank you, guys. Thank you.